This demonstration is on the Appointments feature in Crosslink. To access the Appointments feature, start at the Work in Progress screen, then click on Today's Appointments. From here, you can set or view the appointments for the day. Or, by selecting a different day on the calendar, view an appointment in the past or future. To add an appointment, click the Add icon. In the Subject field, enter the client's name, return type, or any other topic you wish to identify this appointment. The start time will default to whichever day you have selected on your calendar and the current time. The date can be adjusted by clicking on the pull-down menu here. The time can be adjusted by clicking on either the hour or minutes and using the up-down buttons or by typing in the correct time from the keyboard. The preparer's name will default to the person who is currently logged into Crosslink when the appointment is set. The preparer's name can be changed by highlighting the preparer's name field and using the drop-down here to select the appropriate preparer. Set the duration or expected time of the appointment from 15 minutes to all day by using the drop-down menu here. Set a reminder using this drop-down arrow here. Put in any notes about the client or the return in this section labeled Notes. If you use Microsoft Outlook as your primary calendar, you can export your appointment to that application by clicking the Send to Outlook button. And if you would like to include your client's contact information in your Outlook calendar, fill in these fields and put a check mark in Include Contact Information. Click Cancel to exit the appointment without saving. Click Save to save this appointment to your calendar. Edit an existing appointment by clicking once on the appointment and then clicking the Edit button in the upper left. To delete an appointment, click once on the appointment and then click the Delete button in the upper left. You can also set an appointment from inside a return. Simply click the Appointments button here in the button bar. From here you can print, edit, or remove an existing appointment, or add a new one. You can also close this screen by pressing the Close button. To add an appointment from this screen, click the Add button and the appointment screen will open with the taxpayer's information already filled out. Just add the date and time, as well as any additional notes, and save. You can see this appointment has been added to the list. When you are done setting or viewing your appointments, you can click Close at the top of the screen to return to the Work in Progress screen.